Ine Aluga responded in the best way after being targeted for criticism by social media trolls. Ine Aluko has responded to social media trolls who criticized her for mentioning an incorrect statistic live on air with a humorous joke before Portugal's World Cup last 16 clash with Switzerland. The ITV sport pundit was hounded by Twitter users for making a small error when speaking after Brazil's win over South Korea, but the former England women striker responded with a self-deprecating joke about her mathematics skills. Aluko had come under fire from football fans on social media, who had cruelly pointed out the slight error when speaking about Brazil striker Richarlison and it eventually encouraged a pile-on, with some users aiming horrendous abuse at the ex-footballer. Her ITV sport colleague Ian Wright launched a passionate defense of Aluko on Monday, defending the pundit by admitting he too makes casual errors but suggested that they often go unnoticed because he is a man, not a woman. But it seems Aluko, 35, found a way to move on from the incident by making a wise crack about her arithmetic skills the following day when she returned to punditry duties for the Portugal vs Switzerland encounter. Standing pitch side with presenter Sima Jaijol, Aluko was describing the statistics involved with Briel Mbolo, who has scored three goals at the World Cup. And when the cameras turned away from the pair, she said, I'll let everyone else do the maths referencing her minor mistake with regards to Richarlison scoring one goal a game. It followed on from Aluko's tweet, which she sent after the incident, which read, Got myself a first-class law degree, 102 caps and a doctorate but maths wasn't always my forte. Jaijual laughed along with Aluko, who could not resist the chance to make light of the situation with a piece of self-deprecation to show that she was unfazed by the criticism of her. Social media users once again took aim at the pundit for calling Switzerland Serbia before the game, but she corrected herself seconds later after realizing her error. Aluko won 102 caps for England and scored 33 goals in an illustrious playing career, having represented Chelsea, Juventus as well as American clubs Atlanta Beat and Sky Blue FC in the lucrative National Women's Soccer League. She turned to punditry in 2014 after becoming the first woman to appear as a pundit on BBC Match of the Day and later formed a part of their 2018 World Cup coverage, as well as helping lead the Women's World Cup programming the following year. After announcing her retirement from football in 2020, Aluko moved into a role with Angel City FC first as sporting director before moving into a new job as director of recruitment. She has featured prominently as part of ITV Football's coverage in Qatar, although at the time of writing, the broadcaster is yet to comment on the social media abuse she has received. Thank you for watching our videos. Subscribe to our channel to get notifications when we post newest videos. Thank you and goodbye.